Uh, we're coming. Meanwhile, that is where Abu Salami is from. And I Davido has been found yet again in Asada. This time around, the singer was said to be owing a businessman a huge sum of money. I'm from Kwara State, Ilori to be precise. Ilori is not a sound that I'm familiar with. Listen to what very dark man said to the businessman over his outburst. Davido for him to return the finances, which I gave him, um, I stalled. He reached out to me through Larry Gaga and said, um, Larry said to me that um, we grown men, that this need not be something that's on social media platforms and that obviously David's reputation, my reputation, as a businessman, is on a stake. Well, that's neither here nor there anyway, but the main thing is negotiations are stalled because um, David cannot come up with the finances. We've given him options to pay installments, we've given him options to pay half of the payments and um, he's come up with his egoistic attitude of trying to bully people and trying to bully me. First, let me say this, David, that would not work. I say this to you again, you're a thief. I'm not mincing my words. And if you're going to throw your father's name in the mix and say because your father's a billionaire, he's going to contact the IGP, your father said to you that um, he's going to handle the situation, I promise you, I will embarrass Mr. JDK. And I need not be saying this. But I will embarrass him because I won't be bullied. You're either going to pay me back the finances or have a problem to deal with. And that, that decision is yours, really, because that problem is literally me as a person. I will not stop fighting. I will not give up. I will not be relentless. I have 46 boys in the camp that I have to feed every time. Not once have you thought to check on their welfare. How is Abu doing it? We're in a business transaction, and I'll say it to the public. What was our business? Very simple. I want a contract for 500,000 US dollars. And I put to David and I said to David, David, come into business with me. Influence this project. If you influence this project, we stand to make X, Y, Z. I opened up the business plan to him. And he thought this is a lot of money. Because it is a lot of money. Football business is big business. And he said, oh, but this is a lot of money. When I went and spoke to his sister. All right, um, first of all, there's nothing I will say about this matter that people will not find a fault in because um, right now they've already flown with the narrative that I am under the Vidos payroll and then a lot of people are just waiting for me to make mistake because if you check online lately, you see the hate. It's not just hate, it's jealousy. I think a lot of people are paying that, oh, why is this boy going viral for some reason, you know? Well, it is because um, I have sense and I think outside of the box. So now let me just pitch my two cents, you understand? Now, Abu is saying Davido is owing him 280 million. This was what I said before. Davido is owing you 280 million, right? Now, 12, now I know the kind of business or now do. Do you understand? You have a good case, like I said. You have a good case. Don't let all these people push you. Everybody that is pushing you, first of all, let's talk about the people that are pushing you. We have uh, Bonner Boy fans pushing you and Whiskey fans pushing you. It is normal. In Nigeria, once Whiskey is inside one small Magumago, the video fans and Bonner Boy fans will enter Whiskey. Once Bonner Boy is inside one Magumago, Whiskey fans and the video fans will enter them. They are so toxic. Do you understand? This was one reason why I said I don't even want to bother to be talking about these three people. We are talking about the fan base. There was one day I saw one tweet online, you understand, where somebody said, Bonaboy just did do because of your mother, they are alive. I swear to God, I saw it. Do you understand? There are some people that are wishing the worst on these two people because of all in the name of fan base. Do you understand? All in the name of, okay, you want your own faith to be reigning. Do you understand? There are some people today that they are praying that we skid we enter Moto and go buy. I tell you for free. There are some people that are waiting for Bonner Boy to enter Moto make it buy. There are some people that are waiting for David to enter Moto make it buy. So that their own faith go do on top. It is that bad. Do you know that these people, all in the name of fan base, they've created different groups on social media that will be using to report anybody that supports another person. It is that bad. These people have created groups that when they go online, do you understand? They set up some people. For instance, now, you are, Davido is having a wahala with people. Somebody will go and comment on that, maybe like on that gossip mail comment section. The person will go and comment. Their own people will come from the group to go and like the comments so that it will look as if, okay, yeah, that's what it's all about. There are a lot of toxicity inside this whole thing. So this is why a lot of people will not tell Abu the truth. You understand? Now they are saying the video is my guy. 
fine and good. I know David, eh, that one day. You understand? But it doesn't mean I will take away the truth and I will just let. It is not by dragging. A lot of things Abu have done is wrong. You have a very beautiful case. We are talking about 218 million Naira. We are not talking about 250,000 Naira. There's no shouts that Abu wants to do online that will stop the video from going to shows. There's no shouts that Abu wants to do online that will make them pull the video contract from him. There's no talk that Abu will do. We are not talking, you get some people if you start the talk. For instance, now we start to talk about a particular business. Mm? Let's talk about a particular business. Start dragging the business. A lot of people will have reason not to patronize that business. Do you understand? We start to drag, okay, maybe we'll drag one uh, vendor where they sell clothes. We say this vendor, if you pay her money, oh, we'll not do contracts. You buy clothes for her, she no agree with her. You don't understand? You buy gadgets, you buy this, you buy that. Those are people that work online. Do you understand? Now, this guy is talking about all these things online and he claimed to have proof. Where will you get your money back apart from a lawsuit? Everybody that is talking to you online are talking to you online based on fan base and finding oh my my favor will never do this sort of thing. They will go and pay up your money, this and this and that. A case that you have, a beautiful case where you go carry go law court. You can't come online. Now you don't spoil the case. You're calling him a thief. You understand? All these Nigerians where they follow you talk, they don't follow you go courts. That is fat. Leave all of them. I know the sentimental people, it is normal. Do you understand? Because of fan base, they don't follow you go cops. It is just the truth. Take it or leave it. Let's say they don't pay blood. But it is fat. Think with your brain. I know a lot of you don't think. Everybody will not follow you to court. You don't defame him, first of all. You don't call him thief. He's an international star for crying out loud. Do you understand? You don't talk to him, boys, by person. They no buy, you don't bring proof. Through through they no by person. You understand? You don't you don't really spoil a lot of things. Now you don't they go for a father. Now you don't they go for a father. You don't they disrespect the boy father again. You don't add in father to your collection. Do you understand? All these things now. Maybe you carry this your case, go leg out cause you know few now. Do you understand? Even at the day, at the end of the day, let's say you even win with you, they talk about money when you go come out from there and say no go reach one million. Don't let all these people they online us the ginger you. They the ginger they talk rubbish. All of them. How many people get this online? Most of the people online say they don't know they are left from their right on a normal day. Mm? I want somebody where get sense. Make it tell me how Abu won't take you in this case like this. I want somebody that is reasonable to tell me. I don't want all this mumu. I want person where get sense. May tell me how Abu won't take you in this thing by coming online to come and drop all these things without better evidence. Only you want to talk to the same boys, me they come beat you. Wear videos. You all will learn. You see sentiments for this country. Una go learn. I'm gonna go learn the other way. I'm gonna go learn.